All right. Ask, ask, ask Yan to run it. You? All right. Getting it started with a dash attack into up air. Squirtle is going to start. Dan Listo is amazing. I appreciate him putting on these events every other week. Sunday is where you can tune in. Run that fade here at the barber shop. And switching to Ivy Sword. Now, now is when I expect to see a little bit of a pressure. And the up air, up B. Uh oh. And the fair not going to take it. That is a big monkey. Oh, and the back air punishing him. Powering through the up B. This is some wild and crazy interactions only coming here. And Spanky going for the up smash out of shield. Just spamming the up smash. Tres Comas, you saw him going for that. Why? Oh, this runs off and gives him the big monkey fist. Double pounds him in the face. And Squirtle's going to start his combo string. No, he gets out of it, drops the combo. But once again, being put in the string. Oh, the trainer switches out of the grab situation. Interesting. And oh, up air. That platform is not where you want to be. B reverses with the neutral B, jumps up and back airs. That was some slick movement by Tres Comas. And Spanky, kind of infamous for going and up being on ledge to kind of get you away from it. Doesn't get the punish. And now it's so close. Is he going to do? No, he throws him upwards. Maybe he saw Spanky's mash was too good. F tilt. Doesn't get it. Up, up throw not going to take it. Is he going to go for the back air? No, he goes for the up. He doesn't get it. And Tres Comas accidentally SDs, unfortunate for him. And Spanky's gonna go ahead in the stock. Up smash, no, up air, yes! Hits him with the up air, and now we're at a dead even game, folks. We're, one, we're playing one stock over here. And Spanky versus Tres Comas. Turning out to be an electric experience to watch. Oh, Donkey Punch calls out the turtle shell, calls out the withdrawal. Oh, goes for the F smash, trying to call out something that just was not there. And I'm very surprised that Spanky is not using Ivysaur to down air anytime Donkey Kong tries to recover because that is an amazing edge guard tool. Donkey Kong is so punishable. Oh, oh my God, he's keeping him in the air for so long. And Spanky now switching to Charizard, dash attacking, trying to get something. But Tres Comas, up air. No, not going to take it. Charizard's too heavy. But you know Charizard, he could start any moment. Getting a little bit of fire. Back air. Back The fair. Nair into fair. And Spanky takes it from the brink. Only a 154%. And Spanky plays with no fear. Absolutely destroying him with a Nair to Fair combo, killing him at 80. And he's Donkey Kong, he's a heavy boy. Thank you, goes up 1-0 in a very interesting match. And I assume they're going back to PS2 because that was a very fast encounter. What's good, Giuseppe? Good to see you in the chat. Joseph? Pokemon trainer. All right, back into it. Tres Comas versus Anki once again. On PS2, the run back of the century, of the decade, of the millennia, of the lifetime, we're getting it right here at Run That Fade. Starting off, a little bit of Squirtle pressure, going for a grab, getting the conversions, the bread and butters, you know. Back air, just some fine neutral being played. Trying to zone him out with the back air, getting a little bit of a dash attack, and and he's gonna go for a grab? No, he's gonna keep F tilting. So Tres Comas falls off the stage. Gets a little bit of the water gun, not, not too much going on. But there's the opening that Spanky wanted, and now Tres Comas above him. Back, reset back to neutral. Oh, Tres Comas with the down air up smash. 
And this is where Trescomas wants him. He's putting him in the air. Oh, catches him spot dodging. No, what are you doing? Banky, no. Oh, up smash out of shield. You can't punish that. Why is that safe? And the F tilt, the, the Charles are classic. Banky going up. And this is where I see, you know, Donkey Kong having the biggest issue is that he, Spanky has a character for all situations. Oh, doesn't get anything off of it. He could have down smashed, he could have something. And he heats him, <laughs> heats him into the blast zone. And now it's back to even stocks. These games, yes, so these games don't, don't stay in one person's favor for too long. They always swing back. They're always fighting against each other. Back to back, man to man, they're fighting it out. And Spanky staying on Squirtle, trying to keep him out there. And you know what? It looks like Trescomas is just really good at punishing his Ivysaur, which is maybe why he feels uncomfortable being on the Ivysaur. But the up B is gonna take the stock. Spanky goes up and back to Squirtle, baby. Bread and butters, we're starting the combo string. Up, up and away. No, not gonna go away, but he's still taking 56% damage just for one neutral interaction loss. Oh, tries to catch him with rising neutral bee? Nice rising bullet seed? The wildest, wildest thing I've ever seen. Oh, 10% for Ding Dong is what I'm told. He's looking for it. Gotta figure out a way to kill this Ivysaur. Oh no, off stage, bad situation. Thank you. Flare blitzing everywhere. Can't punish that flare blitz. What's going on? Goes for the side beat. Not getting it. He needs to kill Spanky, but the Charizard. Heavy back throw. Is he going to get a back air? No, he's just going to go for flame breath. And Donkey Kong kind of getting a little bit punished for his bad recovery. Back air not going to happen. But Monkey, Donkey Giant Punch takes it. And now we're at 1-1. One, one. Last stock. Go. Up air, up air. Now Donkey Kong needs to choose his old grab, down throw. Oh, he's going, he's going for it. He said, Spanky, are you going to? He looked, he looked him in the eyes and dared him. No, that's not, no, no, that's not, that's not it. Charizard's a heavy boy, up smash. Not gonna break shield, side B. Side B can break shield, up B, up air, up smash, gonna take it. And Tres Comas is going down. Spanky taking it 2-0 in a very close